Good, Christian. Okay, then you come on a circle and you, you come to walk. But uh, to collect only with your leg, you don't get this impulsion behind, yeah? So I think with the whip, you can support a little bit the leg. Yeah. When I get the reaction, I need to drop the whip, otherwise it just gets yeah. more and more and more. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, because it, it, you know, uh, many horses, they react different on the whip. But what was good, for example, with Carl's horse yesterday, you could see the moment that he touched behind, the tail gets a little bit, yeah? And then he gets a little bit, you see immediately a difference in the movement, yeah? And this is not only possible on the leg at the beginning. Later, yeah. it will come on the leg, yeah? but at, if they are young. And you know what is a good exercise, yeah? Come here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Give me the whip, yeah? And you walk. So, and now you have to rein in one hand. And with the left hand, you touch him behind the saddle. Yeah. Good. So he's already, he's already coming. Yeah. Yeah. I remember seeing you doing this. Yeah. 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 This, yeah. yeah. Very good. And, and because also the horses, they have to accept a whip. Yeah. They cannot be afraid of the whip because he has. Uh, a good reaction on this. The moment that you touch him behind the saddle, he's 10 centimeters shorter. Yeah. Do, do it again. So, with, with, yeah. Super. Yeah. Okay, okay. So, and now we do the same procedure with the whip in your hand. So that you touch with your hand, but not with the whip. So that he has a little bit of confidence in the whip. Yeah. Just you walk him, walk. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. Good, so no, you can see he's sharp enough. He doesn't look like it in the first moment. But and, and important is that he is going a little bit low. Yeah, good, so a little bit low and deep here. Good boy, yeah, good, so yeah, so yeah. <laughs>